They say home is a cup of tea. And while I cherish a good cuppa, something about the taste just doesn't feel right here. I have these gorgeous cups, as the cup is very important to me. I suspect it always will be. I often find myself reminiscing about my beloved cups back in London, hoping they're tucked away safely in storage. I wish I could say it's the tea bags that didn't measure up, but I still have my favorite Twinings Earl Grey. Oh, how I remember when I had the opportunity to work with them a few years ago. That was a dream come true. Imagine getting to work with one of your favorite brands to create content about making a cup of tea. It was a delightful experience, especially when I got to learn the secrets of brewing the ideal cup in their charming shop in London. But back to making tea here in Hoi An. There's something about the water here that just doesn't taste the same. I find myself longing for that good old London water. It really does make for a hearty brew. It's funny how something as simple as the water can change everything. But I'm determined to persevere. I can learn to love the taste here. Because for me, there's something so magical about the ritual of tea. I cherish all the different ways I've captured the experience of drinking it over the years. Each moment a chance to pause and reflect and enjoy the warmth. It's like a comforting hug, a familiar embrace. A cuppa can truly transform your mood, lifting your spirits and grounding you. A cup of tea really does feel like home. <laughs>